Alabama orders female newscasters to cover their faces. On May 22nd, the Taliban reinstated an old law that requires female news anchors to cover their faces. Proof of this new law was seen on air as female news anchors were seen with masks, just, just enabling their eyes to be seen across all popular news channels in the country. T-O-L-O news anchor Farida Sial told the BBC, quote, it's very difficult for a presenter to cover their face for two or three hours consecutive, consecutively and talk like that. Many male actors, excuse me, many male anchors took a stand in solidarity with their female colleagues by also wearing masks in their news reports and using the hashtag, hashtag free her face. An Afghan woman's right, rights activist, Mina Sharif, tweeted, quote, Afghan men showing up for Afghan women is not just a gesture. It's a turn in the story that will change everything. Bravo, brothers. This is, um, so they're using the masks from the pandemic now to just to be able to cover their faces. But yeah, but but the men are wearing their, wearing covering for their news as well just to be like we're going to be if you're going to make the woman do this the men are going to do this as well is yeah although what's kind of funny uh, is that if you if didn't know the background of this news you'd just be like oh they're following like yeah, protocol <laughs> you know disease oh, yeah. protocol oh, i shouldn't have said that but yeah um hold on let's go back to this but people are saying that this is this was expected people in the live chat are like we knew it this is what's going to happen you know at first, they're going to say, they said it's the new Taliban is different from the old Taliban, but we're now like seeing that the new Taliban is the same as the old Taliban. But to be honest, it's still very different than the old Taliban. Like, explain. Explain. Yeah. Like, this is not, this is not okay. Like, what we're seeing right now would not, not have been okay at all for, I mean, she doesn't have a burqa. Oh, you I mean, mean, she's working what? on a TV. Wait a minute. What am I talking about? She's an anchor. Like, oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> she's being okay, so, seen by other men and she's and yeah. she's working. And she has a job. <laughs> so, OK, guys, this is really bad. OK, I'm not saying this is not bad. OK, but it's still still very different from Taliban 20 years ago. People think like I say this as an endorsement at Taliban today. Like, hey, guys, don't be so mean to Taliban. I'm not saying that. OK. But again, as bad as this Who is, is telling you, don't be so mean to Taliban. Who is saying people, that? On the, on, the, on the Persian side, people think I'm making excuses. Be, and also here, people think I'm a secret Islamist Wahhabi. I don't know. Taliyah, but anyways, never mind. I don't want to get into that. <laughs> but but this is still very different. She's covering her face and she's working. Taliban before, we were like, why is she? She shouldn't even be in the streets, let alone on TV in front of all these men. You can I mean, hear look her at, voice. I mean, Disgusting. look at their eyes. Those are nice eyes. Okay. Like, you don't know what I'm doing in private looking at her eyes. I oh could just God. watch. <laughs> yeah, you could, you could just watch. I could just watch the news and just like, just do weird things while looking at her eyes. Like, you don't know that Taliban, Taliban thinks that men, you know, you know, anyways, like but the fact that the fact that this is available to all men to see in private um, is like not okay. Like what the hell? Like think about a Taliban that thinks that you shouldn't even be in public mm -hmm. without your guardian. Okay. And now this woman with her eyes naked is available <laughs> to everybody <laughs> on, their, on their TV screen. And the fact that she even has a job, women shouldn't be having jobs. Men should have jobs. Right, women should be like cooking and cleaning and taking care of the babies. That's the understanding. So, you I'm, just I'm said her <laughs> eyes are naked. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm giving you. I'm trying to. I'm, I'm trying to put the Taliban perspective for you. Like, right? I'm just, like, <laughs> That's the point of burqa. I you, know. You, 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 the burqa makes it so that you can't even see her eyes. I mean, look, she like, like she obviously this is not like it. she takes care of it. Like this is like has makeup and everything. She has mm -hmm. lashes and yeah, plucks her eyebrows and stuff. So that's like, you know, for some people that's good enough. And Taliban knows that. Um. Yeah, I mean, 
I, I bet you there's a lot of Taliban people um, that can't believe that, you know, we are like a lot of people like, like, oh my God, they're making you cover their faces. But I bet you, I bet you there's a lot of Taliban people uh, that think like, wait, we're letting them have a job and they still think we're being excessive? Like, like mm-hmm. they're shocked from the other direction. They're like, are they serious? Like the fact that we're not stoning them already <laughs> uh, is like we're being so tolerant. Like we're no, I'm 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 exaggerating with the stoning. Okay, that was an. What more could you ask from us? What more could you ask for the woman? Like we're like being so we're getting attacked by our own people for being so liberal that they are letting women have a job, and you're telling us that we can't even get them to cover their faces. Like the audacity of you guys. Like that's what they're mm-hmm. thinking. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. (laughs) so anyways yeah i mean no i i understand what you mean this is a funny comment mogambo is saying relatively progressive taliban (laughs) (laughs) too progress that's really what it is this is too progressive for a lot of their members this is way too progressive that's why some of them are leaving taliban they're like this is not what we fought for we gave martyrs. We we gave martyrs to bring Islamic law, and you're letting women have a job. And so Taliban is like worried about their people within them, like leaving and joining um, ISIS K, right? They're like so they have to be like, how do we liberalize um, to the extent where the international community gives us recognizes us, so we can finally start trading and make some money but not liberalized too far for our own members to turn back against us and to uh, for Taliban to break from apart from within. So they're in a dilemma right now. This is like, oof. Here's the thing. I don't think there's any way to have both. No. There is no way to have an equilibrium that will meet the standards of both. It's impossible. Okay, somebody said woke Taliban, and then like, <laughs> Woke, woke you This is the Wokistani Mujahideen we've been talking about, Armin. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Dornav has a good comment here in the tweet as well. Dornav is saying, Taliban, we fought, we fought to give everyone a terrible life. This isn't what we signed up for. <laughs> this is not terrible life. This is, yeah. Anyways, so crazy. Well, I mean, okay, so we've kind of seen things go on a downward, by our standards, a downward decline. What do you think we're going to see moving forward? Oh, it's going to, it might get a lot worse. It, it, okay, so we have reason, new reports that Taliban is back at it with working directly with Al Qaeda. So that's, Uh-oh. yeah, so that's like, uh oh, okay. Habibi. Yeah. yeah. So here's it. They might end up in a cycle. So all of this is going to lead to poverty, and poverty is going to lead to more radicalization, and then we're going to enter into that into that cycle. So and that's a down, you know, and and the problem is that that cycle may might end up breaking the fabric of how society works, and that will the 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 what what every what everybody is trying to avoid is a failed state. You know what I mean? You know, ten years down the road, you know nobody wants to see that. Not, not, not the international community doesn't want to see that. Uh, Taliban doesn't want to see that, and most importantly, the neighbors of Afghanistan doesn't want, don't want to see that. Oh, and also Russia and China don't want. This is something that maybe China, Russia, and United States can can agree on. <laughs> nobody wants to see a failed state in Afghanistan. But do you think anyways. they would even? Part of me thinks maybe they wouldn't even let it get that far. Like, yeah, I, don't think they, I don't. Even, I don't even think they would let that happen. I don't know. Yeah. I, well, I mean, how? How? It's hard to stop it. You know. We'll see. But yeah, maybe the, all the interest, everybody being in line with not wanting to see that, maybe that will what's what's going to stop it. Maybe like eventually people are going to be like, there's too, there's too much economic interest here at stake for us to let you screw this up this massively, right? Like, <laughs> so maybe that will eventually um do something but it's just such a mess that i don't know how can how they can I, i'm trying to imagine how they're gonna fix it uh, i can't imagine how but maybe maybe because it's too much at stake they will figure out something it's so cynical yeah. yeah 
I mean, it's not just the resources that Afghanistan has that everybody wants, right? Especially rare earth metals. No, it's the threat it's, to their own economic stability. It's also a threat to uh, the stability of neighboring countries and also trade routes that everybody desperately needs right now. Very yeah. much so. Hey guys, if you're a fan of blasphemy and sexy Cali, you know, like me, then you need to be sure to subscribe to our newsletter. Link in the description below. Because if you subscribe, we will send you a free copy of our Blasphemous Art ebook. And let me tell you, it is the tastiest blasphemy that you can find anywhere available today. And we are so generous with our blasphemy that we continue to send you more blasphemy every week. So make sure to subscribe. Link in the description below.